Hello everyone, welcome back with another very useful and informative video. In this video, I'll show you if you're trying to purchase any app on your iPhone device and you are having this type of problem, payment not completed, then here in this video, I'll show you how you can easily fix this problem and how you can purchase any app on your iPhone or iPad device without problem. So here, let's start without wasting any time. Here, first of all, open setting on your iPhone or iPad device and here tap on your Apple ID. Then here tab on payment and shipping and here first of all you will have to verify your payment method. So make sure that you have entered the correct debit and credit card numbers and here make sure that you have entered all the information is correct. And if you have entered correct payment information and still you are having this problem then here you will have remove your payment method from your iPhone device and again enter payment method on your iPhone device and then after that here you will have review your billing information and make sure that your billing information is correct and country or region and zip code information is you have entered the correct so if you have entered the correct billing information still you are having this problem then here you will have to go back and again here you have to open setting then scroll down and tap on general then here again scroll down and here we have to search for language and region then after that here we have to make sure that your Apple region and your device region should be same. So if this region is different, then here you will have to change your region according to your Apple ID. And then after that, try to download any app or purchase any app and check that the problem fixed or not. So if you are having still this problem, then here you will have to again open setting on your iPhone device. Then here we have to scroll down and then tap on App Store on your iPhone or iPad device. So after that here you will have to scroll down and here you can see that here's the option of app downloads. Here you will need to turn this toggle on if it is off. Then here's the option of in-app content. Here you will need to also turn this on. Then here's the option of automated download. Here you, then here you will need to also turn this on. And here's the option of app downloads. Here tap on this. And here you can see that here's always ask and always ask. Here you will have to tap on always allow from here then after that go back and here you will have to close this tab after that here you need to force restart iphone device by tapping on the volume up button then volume down then press the power button until apple appears then after that try to purchase any app and then after that check the problem fixed or not so if you are having still this problem again open setting then here you will need to again scroll down then here tap on general then here scroll down and here make sure that your device is not connected with any VPN. If you are connected with VPN, then here you need to test connect with VPN and then try again later. Then here you will need to again open setting. Then scroll down. Then here you will need to tap on screen time. Then again here scroll down. Then tap on content and privacy restrictions. Then here you will need to turn this toggle on. Then here tap on iTunes apps to purchase it. And make sure that all the options are allowed from here. And here's the option of don't require, uh, always require. Here you will need to select don't require. Then after that, go back and here again open setting. Then here again open setting. Then scroll down. Then tap on general. Then here scroll it all the way. Then tap on transfer or reset iPhone. Then tap on reset. Then tap on reset network settings. After that here you need to enter your iPhone passcode. Then after that, after all this setting, hopefully your problem will be fixed and you will be able to download or purchase any app from App Store on your iPhone or iPad device. So that's it from this video. Thanks for watching this video.